everyone um welcome back to my channel i'm super excited today because this video is a collaboration with caitlin from um life with kate's so definitely check out her channel we are both using the same kit this week and um in different planners and obviously we're different types of planner girls so um we thought it'd be really cool to see how the same kit comes out in two different people's um, planners. So I'm going to first of all start this video off with a little introduction to Caitlin and her channel and what kind of things um, she loves to plan with and to do. So I'll drop that in here and then we'll continue on with the plan with me. Hi everybody on Holly's channel. Welcome. My name is Caitlin and my channel's name is Life with Kate's. I was super excited when Holly asked to do this collab. I love her channel and I love the way she plans um, and we get on so well so that's why we decided to do it. Um, on my channel I do pretty much the same things as Holly. I do a lot of plan with me's so these are just a couple that I have done this month. If you think that we plan differently we probably do, um, just a little bit differently but if you would like to come over to my channel, these are the type of things you would. Also, I do lots of budgeting videos. I do my June bud, like my monthly budget, weekly check-in, sinking funds. I also do a home fund. So if you're into budgeting and tracking your expenses, please check my channel out. And if you wouldn't mind and you enjoy the videos, hit subscribe. I wait for you to see my video of me planning using the beautiful kit from the Plump Planner. I'm super excited and I hope you enjoy both myself and Holly's video. Hope to see you on my channel. Bye, have a magical day. Okay, so we are going to be using today um, this gorgeous Planner Magic kit from the Plump Planner. It's absolutely gorgeous. We both decided on this kit because it's just stunning. We both love it. We're both Disney lovers. Um, and we're both pink lovers too. So this kit is like perfect for us both. Um, it's from the Plump Planner and um, I have got a code down below, I do PR for the Plump Planner so if you want to do um, any purchasing from there, there's a code in the description box. So, this kit is what I'm going to talk you through super quickly and then we'll get on with the actual planning. This postcard is incredible, like as soon as um, Karen said she was going to be bringing this to the shop I was so excited. This is a glossy cardboard um, post card and it is one of the reward cards. Karen will send you one of these cards with every single order but they change on the front what the design is. I've got so many of them now they're beautiful and then you can see on the stickers there's little bows you stick them on here and when it's full you earn yourself an extra free sheet of stickers so but this one is definitely going to be in my planner not used as a reward card because it's just too beautiful. I just want to use it all the time. So that's a freebie. That doesn't come with the kit, but it works so well with the kit. So I just wanted to show you that this is the most recent card. And if you are interested in making an order like soon, this is the card that you might likely get. But you can always check with Karen um, in the Plump Panna Facebook group because she will let you know if those are finished or if they are still in stock. So let's talk through the Plump Planner Magic, uh, Planner Magic pl main kit. So the first thing I got was the um, large cover sticker. Now this is an add-on. So with the Plump Planner, you can buy the whole kit or you can buy it in sections. I think Caitlin has bought the entire thing. I buy it in sections though, because I like to buy what only what I'm going to use because it saves money and it saves paper and waste. Caitlin uses a lot more stickers than me, I think, in her spreads. So... I'm going to show you the a la carte way that I've got this kit and she'll show you the way that she uses it all. So this is the um, yeah large cover sticker which I'm probably going to use to cover up an area of the week that's a little quieter with us in lockdown. This is nice because it covers up areas of sort of void where there's not much going on. This is the main kit and I think it's £2.35 for the main kit and obviously you can get discount on that as well so it's super affordable and you could just use this. Um, I got the add-on because I like the washi but we'll go, go through one at a time. It's got the eight full size boxes in the standard size. Um, it's the I think she's got it down now as the standard size because 
of recent planning events and things that have gone on, she's rebranded um, all of the certain plan name and gone to, I think, a standard. I'll put it in the description box if I'm wrong. It'll either be standard kit or vertical kit or something like that, but I will let you know in the comments, uh, in the description. Then we have the um, half boxes and some more headers, some deco, the weekend and the notes sticker, which I love. And then this one is a little bit wider and goes in my notes um, column. So love those. And then we have the add-on kit. So I always get this because I really like the washi to be cohesive with my kit. So this is the washi with the gorgeous little headband and mini ears. Um, sorry, I wonder what that noise was. It sounds like there's a goat in my house, but it's just my son on his tablet. <laughs> He must be watching something random with my uh, husband. So there's those, you get the quarter sheets and the important box and also the full box checklists, some icons, to-dos and then a, like a, I use this for meal planning but it's up to you what you use it for. And then it has also the headers and some little trackers. So that's enough for me, like I don't think I would use the um, date, oh no, I'm saying that. I was gonna say I don't normally use the date covers but, oh, look at this mess, this is all from my monthly, sorry. I do need to use the date covers, don't I? Because I'm green this month. Ooh, no. Oh, that's really annoying. Okay, I had to go and figure out what I was going to do with this. So I'll let you know. <clears throat> it's going to be the Plump Planner kit still, which obviously is part of the collab but I can't be having green letters at the top of this beautiful pink kit. So I've done a bit of hunting and I've decided that in future I'm just gonna buy the date covers because July is purple. Um, I think I've gotta wait for November now. I've gotta wait a long time till pink comes back in. So from now on, mental note, buy the date boxes after saying that I don't usually need them. Um, so I've done a bit of digging, I'm going to use this kit, which is the Dreams Are Forever, also Disney theme, also pink. Um, and I'm gonna use these day covers with these little foiled beauties from Paper Sheet Plan to put the numbers and the dates on. So it's a bit of a mashup. So Caitlin, I apologize for straying from the Strictly One Kit rule. Well, I mean, it wasn't a Strictly One Kit rule. It was just that we'd use this kit. So um, I'm gonna text her now and be like, please feel free to use other stickers because I have to. <laughs> Um, so yeah, this is what we're going with and those are the add-ons I'm going to have to add in to make this work and make it beautiful enough because I'm not making this kit not look perfect in this planner because it's just stunning. Okay, so let's get started then. As always, if you know me at all, we go straight to the washi and straight to the notes and the weekends because I otherwise forget. So that's what we're going with first. Now let me just check that I'm central because I'm always not central. <laughs> Let's move these gubbins. I've got this Copic. Um, it is the RVO2. And it's lovely colour but it goes through like all my paper. So I'm not sure when I'm going to get to use that. So here we have if I just... There we go, perfect. We're in shop now, and I'm sorry about the light, but it's miserable, even though it is June. So, let's get cracking. Starting off with um, the notes in the weekend, but before I do that, where are we putting this this week? This week, oh, coming up, what have we got happening? It's my sister's 30th on the 29th, but that's obviously next, the week after this. Um, Thursday, Friday, tend to be more relatively quiet so I think I might put this four boxer on the Thursday Friday day and have Monday Tuesday Wednesday which tend to be slightly busier free for notes and things okay so that's that plan so I can put my weekend still there um, across the top oh gosh that was like a, a bit traumatic I feel like not really spoke to you about you guys yet I've just been like ah what am I going to do about this green this leave leave with me I'm gonna figure that out too so weekend is happy up there I'm gonna now do the washi I bought this kit a while ago from Karen um it's beautiful as soon as I saw it I had to buy it 
Um, she just got a new blade, and it, um, if you notice, some of you have keen eyes. Um, it was, it did cut all the way through the stick of paper, but that doesn't bother me. And she did let me know that before she sent it to check that that was okay with me. And I was like, hell yeah! Why, why do I care what this sheet looks like after? I mean, it's only a tiny bit, but she's Karen. If you don't know her, she's a perfectionist. You won't ever get a product from her that's not spot on to the fact where. If you buy an oops from her, you can't figure out why it's an oops, only she knows. Um, I have so many, <laughs> and I'm like, Karen, what's wrong with this sticker? And there's nothing wrong with it. I've literally inspected it, and it's just nothing wrong with it. But she's a perfectionist, and she's currently in the process of bringing out foils. And I imagine that's not been good for her stress levels, because foils are tricky to do, but she's managed it. Um, but if you want to buy fo um, some foils, especially if you want to buy them for a good pr price, go to the Plump Planner. But also, go to her Facebook group because she does grab bags of things that she thinks are uh, oopses sometimes. And they're definitely not. <laughs> definitely fantastic bargains. But you can see, yeah, it's cut through here. But she let me know. So she was like, do you want this or shall I do a different one? And she was perfect. So I don't mind that. Okay. Notes I think we'll do next. And then I'll time lapse you for the headers because you know that it takes me forever to do so notes I'm gonna go on this side I think like I normally do here one two although no maybe I'm not one two three I might put five up in here because I'm covering this one up so one two so this needs to go underneath so that's fine that might not have made sense outside of my head <laughs> sorry um I'm gonna do I'm gonna cover June 2020 up um, with this one with the ears because it's nice and light and bright and hope that it doesn't come through because I want to try and find a sticker I'm sure I've got a sticker that I can put there that will yeah you can kind of see through it but that's okay um, that will say that what date it is so there we go notes you can see it but I don't always use all these I might put another one on top of that because I don't have any white out it's not thin sticker paper, it's just um, it's just that I've not got white out underneath. There we go, that's better. So, June is now covered up, notes is there. This is normally, because I'm not in, an, um, in the size that this was made for, which I'm not going to say any names of because we've, we've um, cancelled them. <laughs> but um, this is a recollections planner, so this doesn't always fit snugly, but I just trim it so it's fine. So I'm going to put that here and I will go ahead and trim the edge off that soon when I've finished. So that's fine, that's going down there and that'll be okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and put this beautiful large box. I'm going to have to buy another one of these because I feel like I want this decorating um, everywhere. Now do I put it covering the headers or will it fit snug? use this process and just need to figure it out before I stick it down I think hmm yeah I'm gonna do it underneath because um I really want that top row to be um got foiled and then there's I'm gonna stick headers over this bit at the bottom anyway so love that Oh, they were, I wish I'd have black. I wish I'd have white out. Would have used white out on those or stuck something down under those. Stupid green. Never mind. Never mind. Stop being a perfectionist. It looks beautiful. <laughs> it's just a shame that I didn't white those out underneath. Oh well. I'll know next time. Okay. And then I'm going to put this important thing over here in the column at the end sweet I like how that's looking already okay so I'm then gonna now time travel time travel you guys um, <laughs> I'm gonna time lapse you um I mean I guess it's like time travel isn't it it speeds you through the boring uh, chat of me putting these on I'll time lapse you I'll put all of the headers on and I'll play around with these top bits and then I'll talk you through what I've done afterwards actually scrap that I need to put these on first so I know if I'm gonna look like change where the headers need to be so oh so many cute choices right this week is going to go first because it makes sense for that to go at the start of the week and I'm going to put that there 
then I'm trying to think how I want this to look because I'm gonna I want to try and kind of stagger these so I might put one there and cover over that so I'm gonna use this really oh so cute oh guys there's a Harry Potter quote on there how did that just come <gasps> The Deathly Hallows too. What's going on here? How did I not spot that before? Oh, uh, this kit's gone from like absolute perfection to absolute divinity, hasn't it? It's got Harry Potter in it too. That's amazing. I'm so impressed with that. Like, so impressed with that. <gasps> I nearly did it again. Guys, I need, I feel like I need like, just my planners to shout at me and be like, don't stick it down without covering it up. So I'm doing that so that it's not as obvious when I do this. Yay, see that's so much better. Should have done that there. Oh, and the sun's coming out. Excellent. Okay, that's nice. I like that. So then I'll only need two headers on that day. Sweet. And then I'm going to put one here in the middle. Guys, I'm so impressed with that. <laughs> We've got Starbucks in here. This is the most perfect kit. Who drew this? I need to go and find them. Is it Was it Darcy DuBose? I feel like maybe it is. It kind of feels like hers. This is going in the middle. I'm totally procrastinating today. I should, I mean, it's not procrastinating because I'm supposed to be doing this, but I, uh, I need to do my Father's Day stuff for my dad and also my husband. But, um, you know, some things have to just come first sometimes. <laughs> I will do that, just not yet. And then, yeah, I'm going to stagger this week. I'm feeling the stagger. I've done it again. I've done it again. Guys, I'm so sorry. I am not a professional. <laughs> this is why I could never be on, like, um, like crafts TV. Because <laughs> they'd be like, pull yourself together, woman. How can you make the same mistake so many times? But, you know, I can. It's a gift of mine. Love that, love that, love that, love that, love that. Okay, last one to go in this week. I'm gonna do this one because I want like the Harry Potter vibes to come towards the weekend. Fool me once, shame on me. Is it fool me twice, shame on me? But I'm not doing it a third time because I got it now. I'm there. I'm just gonna, uh, a little bit. Am I going a little bit? Yeah, but not, not symmetrical with the one over there. Because I want a little quarter box thing to go down there. Cute, love it, love it, love it. Okay, and when the sun shines, that's just really bugging me. I can't peel it up though. No. Okay, and then this one I'm going to put on this Saturday. Because that's when I film my plan with me. So... I'm going to go with the staggering all over the show. Can't stop me now. Sweet. And I'm going to put one up here too. Not wait to go back to Disneyland. I haven't been since I was um, 12 and I'm desperate to take my family um, but they're a bit young. Theo is not yet one, Grayson is not yet four and so we're gonna wait a little while. Okay that sticker sheet is done, thank you very much. This is gonna go here because I feel like it can be like a continuation of that and then I'll stick a header where the header needs to go but oh no uh, I don't want two, two next to each other so I'll do it here we can still do that tell me if you are a Disney fan have you been to Disneyland Disney World whereabouts in the world did you go if you've not been do you want to go and what's your favorite attraction because I want to know it all. I haven't been since the Harry Potter world arrived there, so that's my main aim in life now, is to get back there 
and go to Hogwarts. Thank you, because I thought I was a witch when I was 11 and it never quite worked out. Right, there we go, there's those. And now I can go ahead and do the headers like I said I would about 10 minutes ago. <laughs> All right, I'll do that now. Bye. So I used the headers from the kit all along the top and then along the boxes that were um, showing, the ones that I hadn't covered over. And I also put some over the full box because I just thought it looked better than the green popping through. Okay, so headers. As you can see, I made a few decisions. I decided to put headers over this because <laughs> it was really bugging me. And I also decided to put headers here, even though they were um, cutting through. And I don't know whether I'll put one on the top of this, let's see. Just because it's quite white, and I wonder whether I want to just, like, statement the fact that it starts there. Yeah. And I'll do the same over here. Just because it's a white at the top of the sticker, I want it to have that sort of definite end, definite start, meant to stagger it, wasn't an accident type situation. Yes, I like that. Perfect. And now I'm gonna go and put these foiled, gold foiled, and this is not part of the kit, this is from Harriet Wright Designs. So actually, no, I'll do all the additions at the end. Everything that's Plump Planet, I'll do first. Let's be fair and show that. And then I'll add the additions on afterwards because it's not fair otherwise. Because it won't look the same, obviously, <laughs> because um, it's not from the same shop. So let's keep going. I'm going to now, pull back in what I've got left which is still a heck of a lot so we have over here notes we've got important and then I'm gonna add in to do I've got a dream is a wish your heart makes now in my head oh I wish I'd put something in between there now I don't mean I forgot they were so similar um and then I think I'll go with this meal planner I am currently dieting, boo. So I am putting this in here in the hopes that it will help me plan some meals out. Lovely. Okay, so that's that sidebar done. Let's just check you're actually in the shot. Yes, you are. Okay. Um, I'm going to put a tracker at the beginning of the week because why would we put it at the end when we need to be tracking from day one? This is what she meant when it had cut through. But it doesn't make a difference to the sticker. So I didn't mind. Here, and that fits ooh, perfectly in that little gap that I've left for it. Lovely jubbly. Um, and then I'll leave that tracker for now because I don't think I'll need another. And then I'm going to come in with the half and the quarter boxes. So, <clears throat> excuse me, so. I'm going to go with a half box on Tuesday. I work on a Tuesday, so I put the um, paper shirt work sticker in there. Um, but So I'm going to leave a space for it to go in there. And then under here, I'm going to put a half sticker. Come on. Down at the bottom. And a bit of deco. Here in the form of this little pencil case because it's super cute all right and then I'm gonna do quarter box in this little gap that I've left for it and I think another one up here and I'll see what I'm gonna add to that in a little while so that's kind of that page nearly done, apart from the top parts. And then on this side of the planner, I'm going to put quarter box. I love this one with the sweets, like that little, little pop of yellow. It's so cute. Here. And then I'm going to do another half box down here with this little goose, ghosty ghoulie cutie on. This would be a really good kit for Halloween if you're not wanting to sort of go down the autumn dark orange, burnt orange type look. Sweet. Um, and then I'm going to put a quarter box 
here and next to it here. So that is that sheet couplet. And I'm gonna use in a little while, you'll see, um, a Harriet Wright Designs foiled little arrow to mark the, I'll show you. It'll make sense in a bit. <laughs> oh boy, it's wonky, stop it. Guys, on a scale of one to absolutely not, how much more professional have I become? The more I do these. Nope, no, not, not, not at all. Um, and then what I'll do is I'll put this cute, oh, is it too close to that? I mean, they're everywhere, which is fine because I absolutely love them. Um, I'm gonna stick that down there. I found a space for it. Um, but I want some deco, up here, <coughs> excuse me, up here. So I'm gonna go with this there. And then this tall drink of water. I'm gonna put here. Oh, maybe not, maybe not. Yeah. I don't use these mainly uh, most of the time because I don't like things like on a Thursday, unless I'm writing down like all the really mundane things in my life, which I do in my life planner. I've not got that many things in one day. So unless I'm putting them in this main bar, I don't tend to use them in my weekly spreads. So I save them. And I think I mentioned before, I have a planner club or I will have a planner club when I go back to work um, in a school for the girls. So I save all the sheets I don't use for them so they do not get wasted, do not panic. Um, this gorgeous little um, cloud here. And then I think I'm done guys in terms of um, what I'm using from the Plumper Planner Kit. So let me show you what I have used and what I have left and then we'll get on to additions. So, um, let's go from the main, main kit. So, all eight sticker boxes used and all this one will use and this to-do one used. And then I have some icons that I haven't used, but it's because I've got glittery icons and I use those. So, and also the Plump Planner, if I can find them in a second, I have now brought out foiled icons, which I will use in a minute and show you those but they're not part of the kit. Then the add-on, so I've used all of that, the washi and the quarter boxes. I've used most of the headers and I only didn't use them all because I staggered. And then I've got a tracker left. And then most of that sheet, there's three stickers left on it. So don't throw your stickers away. You use the little bows to stick on your reward cards. But where is my most recent order from the Plump Planner? I've just had it, I've literally, I got it yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go, here we go. Plump Planner Mixed Icon Sheet. I chose gold. So, oh, I wish I had, I wish I'd left space for this. Can I peel this up? <gasps> yes, magic is happening, it's real. Okay, so let me take a picture of this first. Um, no, I won't, I'll just cut that corner off when I take the picture. So, I'm gonna put this over here oh that's so cute with that oh i love that hello you're so gorgeous i have took a picture of it actually before i added stuff on i get so keen guys um oh and also planner magic large cupboard sticker also used so now that i have done that i'm gonna click off this video take a picture of it as is um this i'm gonna oh no i can't punch for this Oh, I wish I could. I might punt. Mm, I don't know. I'll just have it in here, looking gorgeous. But um, I'm gonna take a picture of this and then come back and add on all the extra stickers that I use that are from other shops. So bear with me. So here's how it looks before I use any other shops. I absolutely love it. It goes so well with the card that Karen is currently giving out. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I'm so excited. I'm just about to put this on my stories because I can't contain myself. Really, really gorgeous. I love it. Yay! So, here we have it. Before anything else, excuse my really noisy, clinky, clunky chair. All right, let's keep going. So, I'm going to use the icons today and I'm going to have my little scales on the Monday. <laughs> um because Monday is when I weigh in. So I'm gonna put, ooh, 
am I gonna am I gonna put the scales I'm gonna put the scales here okay and here's how this is gonna work it's gonna be a two-fold tracker I'm gonna tick every day that I stick to diet and then I weigh in on a Monday so I'm gonna put how much I've lost here so that's to do this week I love those foil icons they're so dainty and cute um then we have Tuesday which is bin day and recycling day so if you've got a foil bin can you not use it is it a possibility so I'm gonna do oopsie daisy this here and also the recycling that's so sweet and then my work one's gonna go in here in a minute and then down here I don't know what I'll put but I'll leave it for now because I'll probably write something in there Wednesday Wednesday um I'm not sure what we're doing on Wednesday. I don't think we need any icons. Thursday, I don't think we need any. I've not left any space to write anything on Thursday. What is wrong with me? <laughs> what have I done that for? It's a bit stupid, isn't it? Um, I think we might be having a play date on Thursday as well. I might have to stick. Come back, Peter. Come back, Paul. I'm going to have to stick this <laughs> over this. What a melon. Can we just address today what a melon I've been? Thanks. Please don't unsubscribe. I promise I'm not always this like silly. Right, there we go. I can write something there now. Um, and see, so Thursday's normally cleaning day. So I'm going to, what I'll do, I'm going to put my little floaty cleany um, icons. I don't mean who I, does anyone iron anymore? Comment below if you iron stuff. I don't iron. I haven't ironed for... I don't even know. I've not got one in the house, so that's an indication. But the spray bottle can go there. <laughs> um, yeah, there we go. I probably would have positioned that somewhere else if I thought that there wasn't going to be a hoover or something. I should have checked. If anyone's sitting out there thinking, I could so do YouTube way better than this, which is a mess, I'd agree. There we go, that's cute. I like that. It looks like it's part of the planner. All right, so anyway lovely mixed icon sheet you can also decide actually i don't use any of these um i don't go swimming i don't want goggles so you can get custom or you can get like i need a sheet of all bins so we can get that you can pick any of these and get like a whole sheet of that which i think is really cool all right so let's do this now it's time to bite the bullet let's get the covers over here now i've got a really really bad feeling that this isn't gonna fit over the top <laughs> Oh guys. Oh actually I did see one I need to use off that icon sheet. Yeah. This little cute arrow. And the reason for that is that's me filming. Bloop. Arrow. That's me letting the video be live. So that's what that little gold icon was for. Now come on. Let's see what we're going on with here. Monday. What I'm gonna have to do. Ooh, do, do, do. Will it? Oh, it might. I don't know, I don't know. Uh, no, okay, so it's not going to fit that way. So what I'm gonna have to do is stick something else to it. Oh, if I had white out, that would do the job, wouldn't it? Maybe. I know, these, all this dark in the kit loads. I think I've got some other headers that I could use. I was going to put over, I was going to put, where is it? I was going to put these oops, overlays on the top there, but now what I might do instead is I might have this be like there, and then this be there. That's quite extra, isn't it? But I think I'm going to have to. The colour isn't an exact match, but that's because it's not part of the kit, but I don't think I've got much choice. Right, so Monday, let's just get this done. I'm sorry, I'm a waffler. You've probably turned off like 20 minutes ago. <laughs> um, here we go. Like I said, I'm like due to go out today and I'm just sat here, got no makeup on. I am not ready and I'm going to a barbecue later in my dad's garden for Father's Day. Which is tomorrow. 
There we go, Monday, Tuesday. I think I've rescued this, guys. I mean, it's not perfect, but it's a heck of a lot better than what it would have been. It was green at the top, which is just not okay, is it, when you're doing a pink spread? Cute. And I don't use these anyway in, oh no, in my Hobonichi, so I'm not losing out on those for when I use this kit, so it's okay. I love Harriet Wright designs, guys, and actually, you need to get over there quickly. If not, maybe it's already passed, but she's finishing selling Hobonichi kits this week, so if you are a fan of hers and you've missed that announcement, you need to get over there and fill your cart up with Hobonichi kits, because otherwise you're not gonna be able to use them. Sunday. Saturday. It's coming together now. I can see all those shiny foil every time I move. Friday. Um, Thursday. And Wednesday. And then that palette, so I'm thinking that was a bit rose goldy but it's not and the last thing to do is to put the dates on um with these paper sheet plans for you so it's the 21st so it's 22 one two three four five six seven yay right here we go 22nd monday 23rd They're so cute, these stickers, but they're so small, so they're really tricky to get off. I have to use my tweezers, there we go. Don't play games with me, 23. You're my favourite number. Is anyone else born on the 23rd of the month? I feel like, and, and also, have you seen the, the film, the number 23? It's spooky. I feel like when you're born on the 23rd as well, it accentuates the fact that 23 is everywhere. 25. 26. Friday, Friday. Well, lost myself some followers there. Singing the beeps. And 28. There we go. Okay. See, that wasn't that hard, was it? Let's have a look. I'm gonna stand up so I can actually see what's going on up here. I hope it's still filming. Beautiful. Look at all that gold. Okay, so there we have shininess. And now we're gonna go and add in deco for things. So hang on. This is my mess of foil. <laughs> Paper sheet plans, pound coin sign, because it's payday on. Oh. Oh, it won't be this week, will it? It won't be. Oh, wait. No, it will probably be Monday. I'm going to put it here anyway. Because it's nearly payday. <laughs> we can get excited about it. And I think that is it for those. And then I'm going to get my paper shirt beauties out. Which, shamefully actually, this is where I'm going to get found out. I haven't put away since the last video I did. Just shoved them back in here, so let's have a look. Have I even got them in here? Did I take them out? Mm. I'm looking for my work stickers. That is categorised, but I'm also quickly looking whilst I'm flicking through for anything else that I might want to use this week. Um, work took them out. See, I should have put them back. Have they back here? <laughs> I didn't put them back though. These are the freebies that are too big to go in this. I'm waiting for the big sticker bits. Oh, I need that anyway, so that's handy. Um, no, my work stuff is gone. Printer alignment. This is where my, uh, Facade is broken, shattered. This neat, organised human. I'm gonna get my little 
honey markers out as well because they're really cute. And oh, that's good. That would really work with this week, but I don't think I have any space. No. Alrighty. So I'm gonna instead instead of using my work sticker because it's gone, I'm gonna go with this one with the two little kids attached because. When you're working from home, this is what it's like. All right, I'm gonna do that. And I'm also gonna use one of these little pink girlies. Cute. Right, that's me. Oh, do I wanna use a little Animal Crossing? No, I'm gonna save those from Animal Crossing plan. Somebody asked me for a plan with me with my Animal Crossing planner, and so I'm gonna do that. See you in. Right, work. I'm gonna write work there. YouTube. I'm gonna film here and I'm gonna publish there. And then I'm gonna have this. I love this because it matches my new Copic, which I really love. And I'm gonna stick this beauty somewhere here. Just because it's beautiful and sometimes that's the only reason you need okay i'm gonna go write everything in now and what's more magical than a unicorn nose pen <laughs> it's not a nose <laughs> oh guys a unicorn horn pen so i don't oh i didn't find the um june i will find that in a minute so weight loss that will come in here it's work am I going to go with capitals? I'm going to go with capitals this week and see if it's already wonky. I'm just not with it. Work. Actually, it's a bit too high to write. Um, so work is there and then here. Boys. With. Angela. Now Angela is my mother-in-law and she um, looks after them whilst I'm working. She comes to our house and just looks after them. She's in our social bubble and uh, she helps us with them. Wednesday we always have um, a play date. Oh I've done it again. I've not done capitals. I need to like stop rushing these and go so much slower so that I don't make all these mistakes. I feel like now that I've not done it there, I don't want to do it anywhere else. So I'm covering it up. Since I've got one sticker left over here anyway, I'm gonna cover it. Oh, you can see through it. <laughs> oh, it's funny, but it's not. Right, okay. I'm gonna be a bit more innovative with myself here now. And I've ripped myself a bit of spare sticker off. Just ripped it because my scissors are nowhere to be seen. Right, there, which you can see through, but hopefully two layers of it and you can't. Excellent. Okay, so let's not do capitals. Boys with Angela. Now a lot of people can make capitals work for them but it doesn't seem to work as well for me so boys with Angela play date with April here is my friend's daughter and then at the weekend fire. sorry folks I was just trying to take a picture before I wrote on this side <laughs> I don't like my writing so for Instagram really I want to try and have it so that it's not got my writing on it so here we have a film and here we have um, publish video and then down here what's the date on that so it's the 27th I'm gonna put payday here don't know capitals we should have a drinking game for my planning and every time I do something stupid you can have a shot and then we'd all be merry by the end of it, wouldn't we? Um, right, so film publish payday. Um, I'm going to 
monthly plan here because it's the end of the month so I'm gonna do my monthly plan routine um, and that and if you want me to film that please let me know and I will um, everything that I do at the start of the month to make all of my planning go smoothly through the um, month ahead and then on the Thursday I think we'll probably have a play date again I've wrote a play date in on Thursday for the last two weeks and they've not happened the first time because my son trapped his finger in the door of the car and the second time because it was raining so much that we couldn't go to the park um, so play date with George and then for this I'm gonna um, leave because I'm not sure what I'm gonna be doing on that Friday or that Saturday for now we've not planned it so yeah that's how it looks I'm gonna now zoom you through have a little look at how it ended up and yeah I think we're done this is probably a really long time with me excuse me I'm gonna take it off here here it is so let's let it focus there we go we have the foil tops from Harriet Wright Designs everything here from the plump planner gorgeous apart from the little laptop bunny stickers which are from Papershire, gorgeous foil, Papershire sticker there again, um, I love these foils though, for, look, how, look at the gleam on that, from um, the Plump Planner and the little Copic illustration from Papershire, I have codes for Papershire, I have a code for the Plump Planner and a couple of other shops as well, I don't have one for Harriet Wright Designs currently um, but there will, be, um, there will be them so do go and check them out and yeah I love that. Thank you so much if you've watched all the way to the end because that mustn't have been easy, <laughs> especially because I made so many mistakes. But absolutely love that. Absolutely love this. And I think that Karen is really acing it at the moment. So do go join a Facebook group, show us some love and support because it's a really hard time for planner shop owners at the moment. Um, the whole world actually, isn't it? <laughs> but loads is going on. So thank you so much for watching. Have a really happy and healthy week, everyone. Thank you so much for Caitlin for doing this collab with me. From this moment, as soon as this video is finished, go and check out her channel, give her a subscribe um, and like her videos and go and see what she did with this kit because I bet it looks gorgeous. She's so talented with her planners. So go and head over to Caitlin's channel, have a little look. And if you liked this collaboration, give me a comment in the um, comment section about it and we'll do another one. So enjoy and if you've come over from Caitlin's channel by the way and you've not ever seen me plan before please do let me know so that I can say hi to you um, and thank you for coming over and subscribing if you did as a result of Caitlin's video so have a happy and healthy week everyone my next video will be up on Wednesday um, and I look forward to chatting with you in the comments bye